Now we are two years older. Oh. Yes. It's been a while uh, since we did a video because now we are three! Hi! Assalamualaikum! We are back! Now we are two years older. Oh. It's been a while uh, since we did a video because now we are three! We're not ready yet to show uh, our baby boy, Rafael Farouk. Uh, well, actually I am, but yeah, she's not ready yet. For the Egyptians. Ming says we are superstitious, but we're not. We're not just... superstitious, you're a little extra sensitive. Oh, yeah, maybe, yes. We just don't post so much. We, 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 we like to keep things in the street. Yeah, anyway, the question everything. is why? Evil eye, obviously. What is evil eye? Hassan. Hassan Ayn. Ayn, yes. Yeah. Because you never know what, what people are feeling towards you, what the energy they are sending you. I guess uh, Malaysians, they are not uh, more into that because in our culture, well, the culture nowadays in Malaysia, when they have a baby, they, you know, always post the pictures even on Thursday and all that I even got told off for posting the weight of our baby <laughs> on Facebook and I have to delete it straight away because the mother got upset yeah yeah that happened yes but I'm telling you he's like a really cute boy yes mashallah he's, he's... I say he looks so Malaysian Ming says uh, he looks more Arab. So my question is, when can we show the baby so he won't get the hasad? When he grows old and choose himself. Yeah. Oh yeah, another thing as well. She always tell me that I should say MashaAllah every time, every single time. If we say the baby is cute, mm. the baby is big. Okay, because, because you have to say the name of Allah, either MashaAllah or Tabarakallah when you see something that you like you can actually like you can give evil eye to yourself to your own things so when you see other people's stuff or your stuff and you like it you have to protect it from the eye so you say MashaAllah or Tabarakallah so yeah we don't go out much we're going to the town again Yeah, spring is here. Spring, yeah, sun, much better. Yeah, it has been a cold winter and there's no snow at all this uh, season. And of course, we had a, a baby during the winter. So you tell me about the birth. Yeah, remember how it was during the labor? Traumatizing experience. Actually, I wasn't allowed to go in until the baby's coming out. Yeah. But yeah, she kind of screamed at the doctor to let me in or whatever. Yeah. And they actually, the midwives. Did, yeah, and the mid, it was uh, like what eight hours of uh, contraction. It started in the morning, like eleven around eleven a.m. And you came and visited me yeah, around like one. One, two, yeah. They were like minor, minor, yeah, bearable, minor. It, it, it went really bad starting 5 p.m. Yeah. So from 5 p.m. to 1 a.m. They were like hellish. Yeah. And like 10 p.m. She called me and she said she's going to die. I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> so yeah. I went straight to the Drama hospital. level 100. Yeah. So I went straight to the hospital. We were just risking whatever. And when I arrived, it was like 10.30, 11. And they let me in. She was like... Scaring all the pregnant people <laughs> oh, I had wait. to actually apologize the next day to yeah. like a, a certain mom Yeah, she was yeah. shouting And then uh, just after 12 He's like, he's coming out already And actually, 
she was supposed to go for an epidural but uh, it was too late he was what the, what the uh -uh. Didn't give it to me. Yeah, because it was too late. Because he's coming out already, and you need time for epidural. And Alhamdulillah, yeah, you were really strong to do it naturally. I couldn't believe that she did it naturally, but yeah, I was there all the way. And when our little boy came out, it was like the best thing ever. Even until today, we still have a. Problem sleeping at night. Do you have lack of sleep? Lack, lack of sleeping, yeah. Lack of sleep until today. But slowly it gets better and... Like you can find main napping on the toilet sometimes during the day. <laughs> <laughs> so, how about you? How's motherhood? It gets to your head in a way. Like what? What do you mean gets to your head? Like you always feel guilty. You always feel you're underdoing stuff. You're not doing enough. And they keep telling you, you're the safety of the baby and blah 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 and you feel like, I don't know, it's, it's, it's overwhelming and, and the lack of sleep, obviously. But Alhamdulillah, it's like a, a big, 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 I think it's the biggest gift. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, it's really nice to really spend the time and seeing his growth bit by bit and new stuff that he's doing, you know. Day, yeah. Now he's like uh, discovering his touches. His hair, huh? City of those. Yeah. Anyways, uh, COVID update. The boring old COVID. Yeah, it's been two years. Also, yes, our anniversary. Time. This is the, our anniversary and Corona birth anniversary. Yeah, as you can see, we don't wear mask anymore. Of course, there's still cases, the Omicron, and inshallah in may everything will get better and you all can come here or just contact me you know here it is uh udine it's like a ghost town it's supposed to be a lot of people but i think it's the lunch hour Hi. strollers strollers very tricky Order. Very tricky. People, people started to show up. Look at that. Even the Mona Lisa is wearing the Italian jersey. This is the castle of Udini. We're gonna buy each other gifts first or yeah, go, each other. or go eat a anniversary cake huh? I need my gift from here yeah oh this is the square Udine square so many people so here we are, one of the main spots in uh, Udine. But yeah, I don't have any friends yet here, so there's no one to hang out to have coffee with. But it's really nice here. So this is Reem's favorite uh, cupcake shop. So we're gonna get, get some cupcake. How does it feel like after two years being stuck with me? I think that first year was really hard. Uh, yeah, it was really hard, but at the same time, it was good because it was really hard. Yeah, because like we get to know more of each other and we it. how does it feel like now we are three um, how is the love compared to just the both of us it changed because i saw you in another oh. I saw you. Wait, 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 no, really. 
Yeah. I'm a cool father? Uh, I think you're a nice father. Hey, cupcake rice. What do you what's your question? I don't understand. My question is, is like what? after two years I still don't understand you. <laughs> what's your uh, feeling after two years? Feeling I have something to look forward for now. Look forward to in him, not in us. Okay, wow, okay. No, it's nice we evolve. We evolve as a family. I'm doing it. So it's really nice. And yeah, having Farouk is like uh, something different. Love. Your love is more whole or wide, you know? Sa. Like, you know, before it's just growing higher or above, but now it's like growing wider. You know? Okay, so it's more horizontal than vertical. Yeah, something like that. Okay. I, think, yeah, I don't know how to explain. Okay, Ming. Congrats, well done. Congrats, well done. Well done, yes. well done. We're gonna fight after this <laughs> because people are gonna watch it and <laughs> give you evil eye. This has always happened. See? Anniversary gift. So, uh, that's, that's it, that's all we can do? Yeah, that's all for now, our latest update. We're not gonna be doing a lot of videos because we have to take care of our kids. And yeah, in because, Ramadan... And because we don't have time. Yeah, we don't have time. And Ramadan is coming. We're Inshallah. gonna show you more of Ramadan because we're gonna go somewhere really nice. Inshallah. Yeah, it's gonna be special Ramadan. For us and yeah thank you for happy watching happy anniversary me happy anniversary ciao ciao bye